Objectives Number one, to discuss the different symbols of inequalities and how to use it. Number two, to solve some examples of inequalities. Inequalities are mathematical expression involving the symbol greater than, less than, greater than equal, and less than 2. To solve inequality means to find a range, or range of values that an unknown x can take still satisfy the inequality. Inequality symbols less than, greater than, less than or equal to, greater than or equal to, and not equal to. Hi guys! Welcome again sa YouTube channel ko. Ngayon, isusolve natin ang equalities 2x minus 5 less than 1. So, alam natin pag inequalities, gagamit tayo ng greater than, less than, greater than equal, less than equal, or not equal. So, paano natin siya isusolve? Ito, simple equation lang to So, 2x. So, ito, less than 1. Pag lipat sa kabila, magiging 6. So, we know 2x less than 1 plus, ay, sorry, 1 plus 5 is equal to 6. So, again, ito, magiging ano na siya. So, divided by 2, divided by 2. So, x less than 2, 3. So, paano natin siya isosolve? So, alam naman natin. So, 0. So, 1, 2, and then 3. Let's note, ha? 3. So, ito yung graph natin. 3. So, ito 3. So, ang graph natin, syempre, pababa. Yan ang magiging x less than 3 natin. Ganyan lang. Simpleng equation ang equality. By using greater than, less than, less than equal, greater than or equal to, and then not equal. Okay. Susunod natin video. Hey guys! Balik tayo sa YouTube channel natin. Today's video ay pagpapatuloy natin ang inequality. So, meron akong given na 2 times x minus 3 greater than or equal 3x minus 4. So, paano natin siya isosolve as inequality? So, first, we will distribute. This will become 2 times x. This will become 2x negative 6. So, less than or equal to 3x minus 4. So, paano natin siya isosolve? So, this will become 2x. Ito, paglipat sa kabila, magiging negative 3x. Tapos, greater than equal negative 4, yung pa, negative 6, paglipat lipat sa kabila, magiging positive 6. Yan. So, we know that 2x minus 3x, this will become negative x. Then, greater than equal to... Oh, so, ito, negative 4 plus positive 6 will be 2. So, x, take note guys ha, ito, i-divide natin by negative 1. So, ito, 2, ito ay magiging negative 1, then negative 1. So, ito, itong, ano natin, papalitan natin siya ng greater than. Kasi, Ano na eh, less than na eh. Less than or equal. Palitan natin siya ng negative 2. So, paano natin siya magiging critical point? Ngayon tayong negative 2, negative 4, negative 6, up to negative 8. So, paano natin siya gagawin as a bug? So, ang magiging ano natin, negative 2 ha. So, pataas siya. Take note. So, this will be a negative gray, ano, less than. Sabihin na, mahaba pa. So, kung yung line natin, yan ang magiging answer for x less than or equal to negative 2. So, yan ang magiging graph natin. Pataas. 
Kasi mas mababa pa yung negative 18. Basta negative 8, mas mababa, hindi mataas. Kung baga, going to the right as a negative. Hi guys! Welcome again sa YouTube channel ko. Today's video, tuturuan ko kayo ng pag-solve ng inequality. Mag-inamgamitan ng greater than, less than, uh, less than or equal to, or greater than equal to, and then, not equal. Okay, so meron tayong given 2 times x plus 2 less than or equal x minus 3. Paano natin siyang isusolve? So, ito ay didistribute natin. 2 times x, 2x. 2 times 2, 4. Tapos, less than or equal to uh, x minus 3. Right? And then, after that, so, 2x minus uh, x Ito naman, less than or equal to negative 3. Tapos, lipat sa kabila, magiging negative 4. So, this will become uh, x less than or equal to what? Negative 7. So, paano natin igagrap ang negative 7? Okay. Kasi, less than naman siya eh. So, negative 7. So, paano natin siya i-graph sa testing line? So, mag-draw mag tayo ng 0. So, negative 2, negative 4, negative 6. So, ito ay negative 8. So, hanggang dito lang siya. So, ito yung x less than or negative 7. So, yan ang magiging answer for our given x will become less than or equal to negative so yan guys ha meron pa akong mga iba't ibang example for inequality hi guys welcome again sa youtube channel ko today's video tuturuan ko kayo ng inequality so pag sinabi mo ni inequalities ginagamitin siya ng greater than less than less than equal or greater than equal or not equal and then how do we solve for this so, first, kukunin muna natin ang LCD ng 3, 3, 6. Tapos, ito 1. Ang LCD niya ay 6. So, 6 divided by 3 is 2. Multiply natin sa 1, x. 3 divided by, uh, 6 divided by 3 is 2. Multiply natin sa 2. Tapos, less than ulit. 6 divided by 6 is 1. Multiply natin sa 5, x. And then, ito ay 1. So, 1, 6, times 1. 6 divided by 1. Take note, so may 1 sa o. 1 over dito. So, 6, 6 times 1, 6. So, 2x. So, 2, 2 times 1, 2x. And then, 4. Less than 1 times 5 is 5, 6. And 6. Right? So, ito. Itong 5x. Isa transpose natin sa kanila. 2x minus 5x tapos less than pa rin yung sign tapos ito negative 6 itong positive 4 pag lipat sa kabila magiging negative 4 so negative uh, 3x less than negative 10 so both sides i-divide natin by negative 3 negative 3 note ha so ito papalitan na natin siya ng greater than Yung less than, papalitan natin ng greater than. So, ano na matitira? X greater than 10 to the 3. So, paano natin siya gagawing testing line? Take note. So, meron tayong 0, 3, 6, 9. Tapos, yan. So, testing line natin. Kukuha tayo ng color term na ang 10 divided by 3 ay 3 point something. So, ito siya banda rito. So, yan ang magiging ano natin. Pagbabasin natin. So, ito ang 10 divided by 3. So, yan. 10 is greater than 10 divided by 3. So, yan ang ating answer. Ganyan lang. Yan lang ang pagrap. 
So, magbibigay pa ako ng iba't ibang example para malaman nyo paano mag-solve ng inequalities. So, guys, ito na yung last video ko for the inequalities. So, paano natin siya sa solve? So, 5 and 2 siya. So, meron siyang LCD na 10. So, 10 divided by 5 is 2. Multiply natin sa 2x minus 3. So, yung symbol na greater than or equal, 10 divided by 2 is 5. Multiply natin sa x. So, 10 divided by 1 will be... Ito, 1 to ah. So, multiply by 10. So, ito, distribute natin. This will become 4x minus 2. Greater than equal to 5x minus 10. So, ito, transpose natin. 4x, magiging 5x, greater than equal to negative 10 plus 6. So, this will become negative 5x. This will become negative 4. Right? Ay, sorry. This will become x. X lang yan, ha? And then, ito, di-divide natin by negative 1 and then negative 1. So, x will become... Uh, greater than or I'm sorry greater than or equal to 4 pero ito kasi greater than so paano siya mapapalabas so ito ay less than equal to 4 so that will be our final answer so paano natin siya igagrap so may gagrap natin or yung yung testing line. So, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. Ito. Tapos, 4 pababa. Less than 4 or equal to 4. So, paano natin siya yan? So, this will be our answer. Yeah. So, yan ang x less than equal to 4. So, yan ang yun lang. So, yun lang. So, Maraming salamat. I hope na kanda niyo yung video ko. Thank you.